Hey guys, uh, I'm Ethan Moore from Stockholm Supply. Um, I got a call from Jesse, who is has bought a used bandsaw, and he needs a replacement blade for his bandsaw. And he wants to know the best way to measure his bandsaw blade. Um, it's kind of surprising how often I get asked this question, but we'll start with the teeth and the size. So when you're measuring the width of a bandsaw blade, you always start from the furthest point of the teeth, not the bottom of the gullet, but the furthest point of the teeth. So this particular blade is 5 eighths of an inch. Um, now if you're measuring how many teeth per inch, split the gullet in half, and then count how many teeth fall within that inch. So if you can see that, there are three teeth per inch on this particular bandsaw blade. So now the length is kind of the fun part. It can be a challenging part. A lot of guys um, will do it with a string. Um, I find a string to be a little bit inaccurate because sometimes strings they have a little stretch in them, so when you're stretching it around the bandsaw blade, it'll end up being a little bit longer um, than when you're laying it, trying to measure it with a measuring tape. So what I like to do, and I find it really simple because it's just one step, I put a little piece of masking tape on my blade. On the inside here, I'm just going to mark a line with a pen. So then what I've done is I've laid a measuring tape along the ground and I'm going to line that mark up to the front of my tape measure and just like a wheel, I'm going to roll it along the ground here. So you don't need to go fast, go nice and slow here. And once that um, line well, will come, come to it here. So you see that line, I don't know if you can see that with the camera, it's landed at 98 inches, which is the length of my bandsaw blade. So that's what I find the simplest way to measure them. So always measure the width, the front of the teeth to the, to the back of the blade. When you're measure, measuring the, how many teeth, split the gullet in half and start there. And then when you're doing the length, I like to lay the tape measure out. So yeah, if anyone else has any other questions, let me know. Uh, email me at info at Stockham Supply or comment on this video. And thank you guys for watching.